Hey guys, how you doing? I hope you are doing well. This is JBL Bar 2.0 Sandbar, all in one compact sandbar, powerful sandbar, compact design. This sandbar deserves your attention. You can connect this sandbar to your TV via Bluetooth, HDMI arc, and optical cable. Optical cable is not included in the packaging, but HDMI arc cable is included. What I want to do is to show you how to hook this sandbar up to your TV. This sandbar is 80 watts audio power. Basically, this is the audio connected to my mobile phone. This is the audio with mobile. Now, what I want to do is to show you how to hook this up to your TV via optical cable. Before we do anything, first of all, you need to make sure you need to unplug the sandbar off from the power. Optical cable is not included in the packaging. This is the optical cable, so you go at the back, okay, where it's written optical. You see optical at the back, then you take the cable go in you need to get the cable if you want to connect hook this up using optical cable so you push the cable inside okay and it's in now i'm going to bring the tv that i want to use i want to hook this up with lg tv from the back of your tv you need to hook the other part of the cable to where it's written digital audio in So hook this cable to optical digital audio in and it's in okay plug in the sandbar to the power then the next thing you need to do is also plug the antenna back to the TV then plug the TV on to the power now switch the sandbar on and when you switch the sandbar you can see it's showing us bluetooth you change it to tv so press tv for it to go to the tv okay now the next thing we need to do we need to we need to switch the tv on once you switch the tv on then you Okay, so now you need to go to the TV settings. It's actually connected, but you need to go to the TV settings. Okay, go to your TV settings. Now scroll down to the sound, showing us now optical out device. So this soundbar is connected, and once it's connected, you can only control the TV using the soundbar remote control. You can increase the volume. This sandbar now is connected to this TV. You just need to use the sandbar remote control to increase the volume. Likewise, to decrease the volume. So this is how to hook this up to your TV. 
what we want to do is to hook this up using HDMI cable. This is HDMI cable, it's included in the packaging. So you take this end of the cable, you go to HDMI out, TV arc. So push the cable inside it and it's in, okay. The other end of the cable needs to go to back of your TV. So take the other end of the cable, go into HDMI into EAC. Okay, so push it inside, it's in. Now plug in the TV and the sand bar back on. So use the sandbar remote control, switch it on. Once you switch it on, you can see it's showing us blue color, which is Bluetooth. You need to select TV from the sandbar to, for this to change. And once it is in TV mode, it will, you will see a white light here. So now the next thing we need to do is we need to switch the TV on. Switch the TV. Okay. And this is the audio once it's in hdmi cable once it's hdmi connection you can control it with tv and soundbar remote control if you want to know the next thing to do is you can go to your tv settings so select the gear okay button from your tv remote control so select the tv settings now i need to scroll down to sound out you can see sand out hdmi arc device so this sand bar now is connected to hdmi arc device and like i said earlier once it's hdmi you can control the volume with the two remote control so this is how to hook this up now what i want to show you is how to hook this up to your tv via bluetooth and to do this so we need to switch off the tv and also unplug the switch off the sandbar okay unplug the cable now switch the sandbar on and also switch the tv on you can see now this sandbar is on and the tv you keep an eye there's a light here it's showing us a white light okay when you want to connect this soundbar to, to Bluetooth, you need to use the remote control to select Bluetooth. And once you select Bluetooth, it will show you a blue light here. So this soundbar now is in Bluetooth mode. Now we need to go to the TV settings. S use the gear button on your TV remote control. Select on it. And once you select on it, then you see the settings here. You need to scroll down to the sound. Scroll down to the sun. You can see this is it's showing us now TV speaker. It's currently in TV speaker. Then you need to select the sound. Okay, use the side button. Scroll to the side to Bluetooth. Okay, this is it's now in Bluetooth. You need to scroll down to look for Bluetooth device list. Select on it. And they will start to look. So now it's searching for available Bluetooth device. Okay, and you see it picked up. The sound bar he picked up JB JBL bar 2.0. Can see from the list. Okay, so he picked up this sound bar now. So the next thing we need to do is we need to just use the TV remote control and select the center to connect. And it's connecting. It's connecting. Here we go. So now you can see JBL bar 2.0 is connected. Now use the remote control for the soundbar and from the TV to increase the volume. We haven't really got around to anything. Okay, and when it's in Bluetooth, you can also control the audio 
using sand by remote control or using blue TV remote control. So this is how to hook this up to your TV via Bluetooth. So now it's in Bluetooth mode. Once you're done that, you can use the remote control to increase the volume. Thank you very much indeed, guys. This is how to hook this up. If you're happy with this, please do me a favor, like, share, and subscribe. It helps the channel. Thank you very much indeed, and stay blessed.